Okay, and we're back. I had to fix the screen, so I have problems with that. And let us continue with this dungeonness. I think I want another shaker here. Yeah, this is a chest up here. An iron sword! Fantastic! Um, equipment, Cthulhu, weapons, sword? Iron sword, <laughs> I definitely want that. Well, let's see, you know what, we have to try a chat feature, what's this? Is that live starfish you got in your hair? Yes, her name is Pensa, Penta. Isn't she cute? A live starfish in your hair. And people think I'm... Sp <laughs> this sp <laughs> I love this game. Uh, I think I could go in here. And we're in a battle. Oh, cool. Um... It was a good battle. Alright, let's continue on our quest to become heroic and take over the- Become heroic, get her power, and destroy the world again! Yay! Why do I have a feeling with the name Cthulhu saves the world that that doesn't happen? Treasure? No treasure, just a long way. Oh, you gotta take your chance, uh, chances when you're an adventurer. I'm a hero. I'm an evil. Prince of Chaos? I don't know. Alright, what do we do? What do we do? Let's use that. And then attack with our might. Do this thing. You just fall the room. Never mind, you just attack with. Oh my god. Thank you. <sighs> so much strategy, but not really. I know. Probably shouldn't do that, but I gotta do it anyway. Oh. How dare you take away the good music? Aha! Victory is mine! Ooh! Yumi leveled up. Uh, passive ability. Combo counts increase. Element success rate. 40. Plus 40 to your strength. Mm, I think we're good with that one. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Dang. You. Okay, this should be good. Never mind. Some money. Actually, no, money's good. Money buys equipment. And a safe point. Let's use it. And continue. Alright. We're out. And we're going up the mountain. Over here. And probably... I'm going to go to that city. Maybe? I don't know. Oh! 
As our adventure crosses the long bridge leading to Miss Miss Cactonia, Miss Cactonia, look at that ocean. A strange beast jumps out of the ocean, hurling itself towards Cthulhu and Yumi. Look, it, it looks like a star, Terra. I haven't seen one of you since my days of Wrinkle XLIV. Time to prove yourself, Groupie. What's up? What about those battles? We forgot to get this point. Uh, we are child's play. Now we show what you got. Alright. Gotta kill this thing. Meaning, we use this technique to use the Kraken power. Then, we use um that and you use... Oh, okay. You have two now. Uh... That. Yumi performs blind strike, one hit, 51 damage points to the Sea Terra. The Sea Terra resistance. Cthulhu performs Ensnare Strike, 2 hit, 38 damage, points for the Sartar. Sartar is ensnared. Sartar hits Cthulhu for 50 points. You summon Kraken, attacks the enemy. You summon Kraken, attacks the enemy. Um... Now, use a potion, Cthulhu, and you use... You don't have anything, so you can use the damage. Uh, use death terror. Oh, shoot. Death blow, star terror. And technique. Seventy-six damage. A hundred and eighty-four damage. Okay. Use a potion. Is that seventy-one damage? Use that. Uh huh. And we perform blind strike, one hit, 51 damage points to the Star of Terror. Star of Terror is blinded. Cthulhu performs death blow, one hit, 77 damage points for the Star of Terror. Star of Terror casts Star Heal. Star of Terror cures of all implements. You, your summoned Kraken attacks this, the enemy. Star of Terror takes 31. Uh, blah blah. Attack again. I forgot to look at the. Um, how much health you have? 198. You could be dead this turn. Um, Uma performs blind strike. Hit one. 51 damage to Star Terra. Star Terra is blind. Cthulhu performs death blow. One hit. 60 damage to the Star Terra. Star Terra uses heal. Uh, Kraken uses that and it attacks with 31 hit points of damage. Round eight. Oh my God. Fifty-one damage, sixty damage, and you are defeated by the hands of Cthulhu. All enemies have been defeated. All allies, whoops, all allies gain full HP on one magic point. You gain sixty-six XP and eighty-five gold. Cthulhu is now level seven. Uh huh. Ha <sighs> ah. ah. Not bad, I guess you're not as useless as I suspected. Yay, I'm not useless. Hey, wait a second. I feel bad for the Star Terror, though. It reminds me of my pet starfish. You know, 
if instead of being a cute little friend, it was a huge terrifying monster. Don't kid yourself. Umi, if that star terror got uh, terror even got a chance, he would have eaten you and every and everyone you care about. But obviously, I'm not stupid. I still feel bad for it, though. Oh, Umi, you have a lot to learn. I, I noticed I changed the name from Umi to from Yumi to Umi. Ah, I see. To the town. I guess we'll talk to you. Welcome to Miss Cactonai. Miss Cactoni. I don't know. <sighs> Let's give up on trying to pronounce it correctly and just pronounce it somehow. What's wrong with your face, mister? It's all slimy. It's better to terrify you with my dear. Nope, not scares me at all. Curses. Uh, curse this curse. Oh, fantastic. I guess we'll start up on the... the up here. Can I find Pokemon in there? No, can't find Pokemon. Let's talk to the old guy. You feel the fool of better. I'm not sleeping anymore. Uh, oh, we're leaving town. Get back to town. And get back to the town. Alright. Well, we're up there, so let's start down here now. Oh, there's a kid. Let's talk to him. Hey, kid. Shanny, Shanny, come back. What's wrong? I was exploring this cave to the northwest of my, with my dog, Shanny. Er, Shane, actually. When... We were suddenly attacked by monsters. I ran as fast as I could, and I could and escaped. But uh, Shan, I gotta call her. I'm just gonna call her Shani. Shani is still trapped there. Gufulu, let's go find the dog. I guess rescuing someone is sort of a thing a hero would do, even if it's only a dog. Quest gain. Find Shani from the dog. Uh, can we like? Oh, well, let's continue in this town. It's a sword store. Clear. Make sure you do equip any new uh, items you purchase. Okay. The sh let's see. Talk to the shady guy or the smithy guy. Talk to the shady guy. Are you thirsty? Yes, I am. Thank you for asking. Welcome to my shop. Our horrific game one. Uh, so weapon, sword, useful sword, so armor, tunic. Uh, buy weapon. I have an iron sword, steel, and trident. No, I'm gonna buy this one. Left control. Power weapon, iron. Or a sharp trident. I think steel. He purchased a steel sword. By armor. Okay. Uh, 30, 10, so this is 50, 20. Cute dress. A heroic dress. Okay, let's see. Well, I'm gonna buy the uh, warrior's tunic. You don't have enough money. Okay, I'm going to exit. Equip my new stuff. Cthulhu. Sell to the sky. So what armor? I meant so weapon iron. And weapon. How much? Oh, oh it just says. 500, we don't have enough for anything. Alright, let's leave. Let's leave and always come back. I meant never come back. Thing, what do you have? Hey, get back over here, you old lady. I love this town. Fantastic. This is leaving town. 
northwest of here. North, south, east, uh, I don't remember. I was never good with those. I love you. I love you too. I love you more. No, I love you more. Ah, uh, true love. Isn't it wonderful? True love! Blah! How old are these kids? Five? Probably. Ooh, bar. Let us drink with the old shady man. You wish to be a hero? Go to the shrine of heroes to the east. If you can pass there, there uh, the test within and reach the highest floor, you your wish may be granted. Fantastic. There's a crazy old man near the edge of town who just uh coming over and over. I hear he's a member of the evil cult that worships an ancient uh false god. Good to hear. I still have followers. Ah. Uh, okay, that's all the time we have, and I will be right back with the other episode.